start with the unlo- uh, the lockdown opening uh, in the city for, uh, between 7 a.m. the morning and the evening uh, 7 p.m. So my walk started again. Today morning when I was returning from a walk, an old friend of mine uh, met me, smiled at me, he crossed my way and he said, Zaid, sir, I'm very happy. Yesterday he had visited my house. I wasn't there. He wanted to hand over a book for me. So he he said, I'm very happy that your daughter Zara is so well mannered. I was quite surprised, very happy too. I said, How? He said, When I wanted went to your home and the, she opened the gate. You're not there, but she wished me, she invited me inside, offered me a glass of water, took the book for you, and she came to gate to drop me and said thank you. Even these small things impressed him so much. And more than that, I was so happy to hear that someone is really appreciating my daughter for her good manners. Ultimately, it boils down to grooming. And as an author of the book, etiquettes everything else you wanted to know, what uh, best gift one can expect early in the morning. My friend, remember, I write in my book the same thing, that manners are the happy ways of doing things. People are always watching your manners and avoiding or denying you praises or prizes or uh, admonishing you accordingly. I feel that uh, there's no doubt. Certainly, good manners uh, soften the hard edges of reality. They lie at the heart of uh, every dealing in life. And I call it the mysterious uh, uh, thing which lies in every heart and that is called charm. Good manner increases your charm, establishes your charm. There can be oil on the troubled sea of uh, matrimony also. That's so important. In my book, Etiquettes, you always wanted to know about uh, everything you always wanted to know about etiquette is done exceedingly well I have said that simple and the most uh, effective way to acquire manners is just imagine yourself in the other person's shoes treat him or her as you would like to be uh, treated and that's all about it my friends the greatest secret I feel is not having bad manners or good manners or any other particular uh, sort of manners but having the same uh, manners for all human beings for everyone you have the similar kind of treatment no selective treatment that's why my daughter's politeness was so pleasing to my friend not because she did nice uh, she had nice manners because she Teach everyone similarly. She spoke to my friend uh, in a very pleasing manner. She just saw her as another person. It is often that we encounter another person who actually sees us. It is not often that we uh, tactfully look to others. It is hard work, my friend, to look someone else and think about uh, him, uh, him or her. Remember, most of us are generally too busy, too preoccupied with our, ourselves to spend the uh, time. Yet, isn't this is what we are trying to teach our children when we reach, uh, teach them manners? We cannot, of course, tell a six-year child to try to project himself or herself into the skin of another person and understand how that person feels. But we can reach him or her to say thank you. And maybe somebody, when he's saying the, wor- uh, the words, when 
he is truly grateful he will suddenly understand what he or she is saying and why when a child shouts my friend give me that and we ask him to start over by saying please we are trying to teach him that about uh, uh, that shouting order is not a good way to communicate with others when we beg a 9 year old uh, child to sit down after any uh, occasion and write a letter uh, simple when your mother, her let's say her grandfather gives some sense of present to her and we ask her to write a thank uh, thanking letter if she is not out station or she is away for whatever the gift she has given she the very act of composing the uh, uh, sentences may bring some realization to all self centered child that her grandmother did spend some time and thought on choosing a particular present for her before true courtesy can be expressed my friend its techniques must be practiced when i see the intense pleasure that courtesy can give i realize that the pleasure is out of uh, out of proportion proportion to the effort that uh, produces it it is more than pleasure in uh, uh, smothered path my friend courtesy is simply a reassurance it is a warm and friendly voice coming to greet us in the dark it is the hand reaching across this empty space that surrounds uh, every one of us i was reading a, uh, a book where uh, uh, the the mark of a gentleman the book was in this the he says the father the author advises to his son he says my my boy treat everybody with politeness even those who are uh, rude to you for remember that you should uh, you show courtesy to others not because they are gentlemen because you are one my friend good manners are simply the shock ab- uh, absorbers of life i feel that samir achhi hai aasman achha hai hum achhe hain to sara jahan achha hai practice good manners teach your children good manners and see how beautiful the life becomes thank you very much